Orgasm Radio The Music Experience Hi everyone, welcome on Prism Radio and we're here in Tomorrowland, Belgium with the one and only Dylan Francis, how are you? I'm not the one and only though, I feel like there's really? some more Dylan Francis's out there do you think that so aren't getting credit you know? There, I know Oh. There's some Francis Dillons, and then there's some Dylan Francis. Oh, damn. Should I do it again, then? Okay. <laughs> no, so no, no, I'm the one and only. One Dylan Francis, but <laughs> he's a good one, so <laughs> that's all right. How do you feel? How do you feel today in Tomorrowland? I feel good. Um, it's not as hot as last week, so that's good. Um, it was raining for a bit. I hope it doesn't... Well, actually, it would be kind of good for it to rain on my set, because then a bunch of people... Would it? Would you come don't into really the care because your stage is actually covered. Yeah. Right. No, so that's what I'm saying. Like, if it starts raining, <laughs> more people are gonna come into the stage. Yeah. It's already good, but it would get packed out. Like, it would be like everyone trying to get under there and yeah, listen to and Mumatone. Yeah. On the and stage, and it's gonna just be <laughs> wild. You know what? It's funny because you're here today in Belgium, but yesterday night you were in Paris. Yes. And I was there too, and it was a great party. You were and there? Yeah, I was there. Oh my God, why did you say hi? I did, but you know, you didn't see me in the crowd. That's <laughs> all right. <laughs> I'm okay with it. But anyway, I didn't sleep, but I feel okay. And it was I a great party. I barely slept too. Of course. So we're in the same boat. Yeah. Uh, the party was awesome. Paris is always amazing for me. Like, I think I've had... From coming to, to to Europe for like five years now, I think I've had the best shows in Paris and Scandinavia. Paris really likes my music, thank God. I, I think so, and you're, yeah. you're really used to the, the city too. You've yeah. done uh, so many clubs there, like social clubs and really yeah. good clubs, good crowds, right? Yeah, amazing. Yeah. And uh, not only the clubs there, I see that you still have your own occupations. You really respect our traditions because you. I saw you through cheese at <laughs> people's apartment, <laughs> yeah. which is which is nice. So thank you for that. Thank you for <laughs> respecting. <laughs> that French. was a DJ snake. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because their windows were open because it was uh, summertime. So we decided that they needed some cheese to go of with their summer. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> That's so random. <laughs> but anyway, you did that and you do so many uh, funny things too. But also, of course, you DJ pretty much everywhere. Yes. Um, like you're going to start the, the block party. Yes. In a couple of days. Yeah. After this, we, we head to Florida to start the Mad Decent block parties. And then we're all over the place for about the next two months yeah that's crazy yeah and um could you tell us what's the difference between like block parties and what you do with the mothership tour um the maddie's and block parties are i don't know they they feel different just because it's with uh like a bunch of our family sure. like it's very family oriented uh, yeah exactly yeah. so it's like a lot of people coming on stage and just getting hyped and it's not really like like headline shows or or like shows like that it's very like no one cares yeah it's really yeah fun, it's just right? really fun nonchalant great shows it's really lots crazy. of great food some, uh, shoots from from the it's crazy it's so and much is fun it, is it different uh musically too is it's it, just is it style it, different yeah it's just like a you know it's all a mad decent style music it's not really main stage yeah. stuff it's like very you know really non EDM. Yeah. maybe yeah yeah different not saying that that's you know, I don't thing. like EDM, but you know, yeah. it's it's very like we play whatever we want, and sure. people are down. So. States, so yes. people in France, just you can't go. Be patient. <laughs> just go. We'll be there soon. Do something, but anyway, <laughs> they'll do it in Europe one day or another. We will. We did it in South Africa, so and it went well. So I'm assuming that we'll probably start coming over to Europe yeah. and doing it. We, we're waiting for that. So I, you, I hope to do, do it in Paris soon. <laughs> and you really um, various in your sound too, in your production. You do so many different things, like uh, all the sounds you have, from Moonbitten to trap music to yes. uh, deep house to everything. What, is it important for you, or is it a choice, yeah. or is it something you just do because you like? Uh, because I love every, I love everything. Like, uh, I don't want to produce one style of music, um, and I don't think my fans should ever think that I do that or would I would I wouldn't want them to want me to do that because I like listening to everything so 
and I feel like the best fans are the ones that like listening to everything as well and like just yeah, because I saw some people uh, a little tough on you sometimes when you change too much. Like, yeah. they write some stuff like, what what you doing? Where's the old Lynn Francis and stuff yeah. like that? Uh, those people are probably going to find another artist that they like. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> or but, they, yeah, they it's weird. It's thing, weird I because I would, ass I would assume that the people would grow with me in the music that I make. Um, but sometimes people just want to hear the same thing and that that's fine. Uh, hopefully they'll catch on later, but I'm not going to do the same thing over and over again because that would just get boring. Sure. And then I wouldn't be able to progress as an artist. And you did find a way, a funny way again to do that is to have some alias, right? Yes. <laughs> some, so you have... Uh, DJ Hansel. Yeah. DJ Becky, Rich as, fuck. Rich as Fuck, Greg, Rave Dad, yes, Trevor. That's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> and none of them have a dad, I guess, so no, that's really sad. None of them. <laughs> but yeah, I, I really invite everyone to go to uh, your Instagram yes. and everything because they can discover all those weird <laughs> Dylan Francis's. <laughs> and, uh, and it, but it's great because you do it well as well because you had this uh, mix of 30 minutes did by, yes. by uh, DJ Hansel, right? Yeah. How, how did this happen, seriously? I just felt like doing it. It how? was, uh, I felt like asking DJ Hansel to do it, and he yeah. did it. He and said yes. Yeah, he, he said did yes. Not, and he he, really say he was really mad because he only got 30 minutes, but, oh. you know, that's, that's I'm something. getting him work, mm. so yeah. <laughs> he should be happy, but he's not ever, so. Yeah, no, you he's know. Never, never. But it's okay. Yeah. He's German, <laughs> just an angry German guy. Yeah, so I have this very interesting accent. <laughs> yeah, sure. So I was driving down Crenshaw trying to find the Unz Deep House party. I asked someone and they said, yes, go this way. So I went that way. I ended up at a trap house. People were twerking. I was not happy. It was not a deep house party. It was nothing deep about it. You do so many different things. What's next? What Should we expect something or don't you? Next maybe you don't is really know yourself. Uh, next is my album coming out in the fall. Um, and it has a bunch of really awesome, cool, different genres of music in it. And um, yeah, Collapse, I heard that. Yeah. You Martin Garrix, yeah. Simon Lord, uh, Brandon Urie from Panic at the Disco, um, Major Lazer, uh, The Presets, um, and a bunch of other people. It's gonna. I, I'm really excited to put it out. I can't wait. Um, and yeah. tonight you're playing on a Madison yes. stage. So how is it gonna go? It's gonna go awesome or not. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh my god. <laughs> no, it's gonna go great. Yeah. It's gonna be really fun. Of course. Um, Cause you're, you're playing with this uh, French guy. I heard a little yeah. bit about him. Like uh, DJ Snake. Yeah. Uh, exactly. DJ Serpent. DJ yeah. Serpent. Mm -hmm. Is he is he nice? He's he I love smile him. A lot, right? No, he he <laughs> smiles when I'm hanging out with him. I know. I <laughs> we did see uh, uh, some pictures of uh, Miami that were really interesting. Too. Yeah. Uh, so I invite everyone to yeah check that all your socials because of course you're on Twitter, Facebook, Everything. Instagram. You were on Vine, but I guess this is not. No, that I quit Vine. So uh, go on that, and of course Prism Radio because uh, we're yes. keeping everyone tuned. Prismradio.com. <laughs>